Hey, what is up, guys? Welcome back to Game Ranch. I hope uh, everyone is doing well. I've been away for a while, so I thought uh, I've been busy with some uh, personal stuff, and uh, I thought I'll take a break and come back. So here I am, and uh, we'll be continuing with the control game. So the last time, what we did was like we spoke with the unknown caller. So we found this telephone, and uh, here we are. The hotline will allow you to contact extra dimensional entities let's see what the dust okay i see something okay i thought it was a bug okay okay seems like that's not a bug so <laughs> okay, I'm not sure what we need to do over here. Let's find out a plan over here. Maybe uh, we could go this way. Right, nothing seems to be working. What I tried was uh, when I shot at it, it changed the transformation, and I thought I could just uh, pull it and uh, throw it. So let's see how this works. I might need to okay it went that way hope it won't follow me here hopefully yeah so you just have to escape from it I guess okay it's coming this way run baby Seems like you just have to run away from it. So there's no way to kill it. There goes the telephone again. It is a phone. It's an object of power. It doesn't connect to any typical network. A direct line to the astral plane and the board. And my hypothesis is, under the right conditions to other planes of existence as well. A director needs a team. My management team. These people know the secrets of the Bureau as well as I do. Some even better. Darling, Tomasi, Salvador, Marshall. Marshall especially, my head of operations. She sees right through me. She knows I don't like relying on people. The only person you should fail is yourself. But things change when you become director. I have it. 
bot line. I can reach Trench. Well, listen to him. He feels more like an echo. An echo with important info. I need to get back to Emily. Okay. People Speaking react to Emily. strongly when I tell them about you. Is it too soon to tell Emily? She might be able to help. Alright, let's see what we need to do now. See, this game is pretty confusing. Not sure where this uh, actually takes us. Got some collectibles. We gotta go to the uh, boardroom again. I think we'll be having this. Uh, what do you call this? A quick travel. I think it's this way. I think it's out. This is where we killed that uh, Tomasi guy and uh, here we go, we have a uh, company. Only one. The hell was that? Okay, here it is. Damn, what happened to my aim? It's been a while since I played this game and I'm currently sucking at it. Okay, here it is. So we gotta go to the boardroom. I think that's where we will be going. Force whack can be bound to an input in the control options menu. Okay. I'm playing in uh, joystick so I can just move my joystick a little further and I can walk so I don't need it. Alright, here. Okay. I thought she was Emily. There she is. Jesse, did you get the hotline? I mean, how is it out there? The comms, the hiss? I, sorry, you made it. I'm glad. I got the hotline. I can make out what Trench is saying now. Incredible. What did he say? He talked about his management team. People who knew the Bureau of Secrets. Your boss, darling. Tomasi, but he's gone. He's gone. Salvador? He's the head of security. And Marshall? Helen Marshall is head of operations. She's tough, ex-CIA. She took her rangers and went to the research sector to secure the HRA production. She hasn't come back. Someone who could help us. The other sectors. How do I get there? It's impossible because of the internal lockdown. You can perform a directorial override to lift it, but that can only be done in the maintenance sector. Normally, you take the sector elevator down there. It connects all the sectors, but it won't work while the lockdown is in effect. We already got past one lockdown. Maybe I can find a way. Jesse, look, with no prep, no training, in this extreme situation, you are doing phenomenally well. And all that and the hiss can't seem to affect you. I mean, I would love to run some tests on you. If... You agree, that is. L we could find out something that would help us. Tests? I don't know. She might find out about you. But I wouldn't mind understanding more myself. Okay. If you think it will help. Great. I'll check the internal documentation for any lockdown bypasses. We need to get these sectors open to locate Darling and Marshall. And I'll look for a way inside the maintenance sector. The sooner we find one, the sooner I reach this override.
Right, mission completed. Unknown caller. Upgrade and unlock new abilities from the nearest control point. I think the control point is what we use that? it to uh, for the fast travel. Where is it coming from? Singing. Sounds like it's coming from the elevator. All right, let's see what we need to do. So we gotta go to the uh, central executive. I think that's where the uh, the elevator is. Got some things to do here. Okay, let's see what assets we have. Materials. So basically, we won't be able to do anything at the moment. So we have completed two missions. So collectibles. I have collected a couple of uh, things here and there. Not really a big fan of uh, reading all these, but uh, probably once in a while I'll be. So we head to the uh, central executive. They're saying Trench was shot dead. The situation's getting worse. I saw Trench and Darling arguing a couple weeks ago. Trench so this is where we'll be uh, working on our abilities. So this is health, energy, melee, launch. I think we have to go one by one. So we'll take uh, each one of these. You don't think, darling? Right, we have one more. Maybe I'll work on the health. But we need three uh, points, so All right. I can just, we'll just see what the astral contract is. Weapon forms, so we gotta find some more so that we could uh, craft it. I guess modifications. Hmm. What's this? Construct a random personal mod. Maybe we'll create this one. It's an energy boost. We got some outfits. We have no outfits. <laughs> All right, here we go to the character override. Hope has asked us to document the his incantation. Might need to go to the uh, central executive. I think uh, we, I think we might need to go to the left, which uh, she was talking about. Let's see. We need to go to the maintenance sector. Sometimes this game is pretty confusing. what we are going to do is we are going to find a way to the maintenance sector so that's gonna take some while i guess Some collectible over here. Don't let mold hitch ride. Not sure what that means. 
the constant hissing is uh, is kind of irritating to me. Director's office. I think we heard lift, so probably we might go and check the lift. the director office just looking for a lift because I heard uh, Emily say something about the lift so probably that might be a hint for us so here we go just the way we came It says uh, it's right here. Probably go down. Maybe we'll find something out here. Oh, there's the lift. No, I thought this was a lift. Does look like a lift. Some kind of weird chamber. Oh yeah. Time to burn. Yes. Lead me in the main So we are going to the maintenance sector, okay. Like I said before, the janitor is a friendly face. I don't think so. For some reason, I think this is the guy behind all this weird stuff happening over inside. Let's see what the story unfolds. I've been waiting for it. Hmm. That's a nice tip. Launch deals increased damage to the enemy armor. The maintenance sector is the janitor on. domain. If I can find Ati here, he can help me reach the override. Maybe it was you who got me into the oldest house with the lockdown on. Maybe it was Ati. It felt like he made the elevator appear that took me to Trench's office. Is Ati guiding me too? Well, I'm telling, I think uh, this is the guy behind this. <laughs> okay, we're gonna jump over here. Half the place is half the place is closed. This game has some uh, dark colors, so it might be the directorial uh, override is right there in the control room. How do we get there? Well, I guess we got we have we might have to find it out by uh, killing these guys. All right, finally some action. Let's get it done. The launch actually does a lot of damage, so might able to use it and make sure uh, we keep moving. Let's cleanse this area. Nice. I guess that would be our checkpoint. Oh, 
Wait, what's that? I don't think we'll be able to go there. Not sure we are supposed to go over there. We got a couple of friends over here. A couple of redheads, right faces. Alright, that guy's done. I wonder if we will be able to get the machine gun. Okay, not sure where this guy is shooting from. Okay, he's done. Yeah, of course it's locked. I think that's kind of a barrier to clear out the uh, enemies. What's down that way? New mission. First, we'll stick to the. Okay, I think we found him. I can hear him. This guy looks way weird. There he is. I hope he's helping us. Well done. You got the job. It's place for congratulations. Yippee, Satan. It happened in the last drop. I truly need an assistant. Funny thing is, I've been a janitor. I'm more at home in that role than as the director. Only Ati here seems to see that. Yeah, hi, Ati. Look, we need to get the lockdown lifted, otherwise I can't get to the other sectors. Can you help me get to the override? Yes, yes. Easy peasy. It's just around the corner. But first, we need to get you working. Very small couple of hours chop. Something tells me it's gonna be more than that. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, you think there's a dog buried in this? I can tell you are not the yesterday's grouse's son. That's why you make a great assistant. Very well. I'll hit the facts on the table. I'm going to swore out that this house has a vermin problem. A bad one. They've already messed up the cooling pumps. And the power generators of a power plant, Berkele. And the pensioner inside. He's starting to feel the pant around his head tighten. The situation needs to be fixed before the plant blows up. And we all disappear like a fart in Sahara. Trying my best to keep up with this. Fix the coolant pumps and the power generators, otherwise the power plant will blow? But don't you worry. I've left you clear instructions. You'll catch the end of the thread before I go to my vacation. The work's on the task board here. You can do later. And you have time. Vacation? <laughs> right. Yes, no one's gonna cancel my holiday or seeds gonna rattle. But don't worry at all. You'll take care of it and soon this crisis gonna be last winter snow. You better go now, so you don't have to run with your head as your third leg. The door in the back leads to the plant. The door in the back. That's great. Thank you, Ati. That was weird. Yep. Burn the dress. Throw it in the fire. 
Alright, I think we just have to go and uh, cool this uh, NCS power plant. Okay, so what happens again if that thing blows up? Power. Explosion. Too much. Director's duty. Keep the lights on. So here we are, we are here to uh, stop this power plant which is about to blow. Not sure if this is it. Right. I found a door and I just... Okay, here we are. Hey, hey, are you new? Go talk with Chief Arish in the security booth. He's in charge here. Oof. I thought she was uh, some his corrupted agent, so I was just going to look out to kill her. But anyway, she spoke to us before that. Anyway, we'll claim this control point. Okay, why is it red? The game looks uh, really great. The assets and the lighting and stuff, everything looks really good. Okay, where is this security chief? Is this the lady who was standing up there? And I missed it. The red lighting actually gives me a headache. Yeah, I hope uh, she is she. That's a he, and uh, he's not. Gotta get uh, into the center of it. Okay, I gotta find a way to go up, I guess. Let's see if we can go through this. Okay, we are here. Field training. I knew this was a dead end. Hmm, there it goes. Why do I keep uh, going into some other mission area? I'm not sure. Okay, where is this uh, security chief? So she's right below. I think the only way we need to get up is uh, probably by accessing this area. Wait, let's see. It's gonna take some time to find it out. So, <clears throat> so I, I just read this. Welcome to the Ranger Field Training Course. The course must be completed in the sp specified amount of time. When you're ready to start, press the button. Okay. I always did love obstacle courses. Well, I don't. 
or maybe uh, it's probably underneath or well, we might have to go over there this is literally running around in circles I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just trying to find out the way, but uh, I'm also not able to clear this area. Where is this lady again? Okay, there she is. It's dangerous out here, lady. Go see Chief Arish. He's just inside. He'll help you. He's inside. The funny thing about it is, I was just thinking about it. To find this chief Arish, it is going to be like very simple. Like go inside this. And I have been roaming around. Hey! hey. Chief Arish, FPC security. Shouldn't you be in a safe room? Alright man, no, just I don't shout. We're on the same side. My name is Jesse Faden. I'm here to perform the directorial override to get the lockdown lifted. Yeah, yeah, Chief Arish, FBC Security. I'm just... Oh, hang on, you're the new director. <laughs> um, it's a pleasure, ma'am. Let's skip the formalities, please. Right. Faden, ma'am. Look, as you can probably tell, it's a bit of a shit show down here. We've been holding our ground, but whatever's gotten into our buddies has them wrecking the coolant pumps and the power converters. The NSC keeps overheating, and my crews keep getting shot before they have a chance to make any repairs. NSC? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Bureau jargon. It's what we call the power plant. You know, the uh, big rumbling metal thing? <laughs> uh, Salvador, head of security, asked me to protect it in case of an attack. See, what's inside is dangerous. But Dr. Darling seemed to know it would be a target. Darling? He's here? No, he came down a few days ago, before everything went to hell. He was out of it. He smelled like a bar mat. He was ranting about vulnerabilities and how he only had one large-scale HRA, but that he needed it somewhere else. Still, at least he gave us these personal HRAs before he left. Hey, did I mention that he was tearing his clothes off? <laughs> Crazy dude. Darling knew the hiss was coming. Listen, I love playing 20 questions as much as the next guy, but we have got to get the water and electrical systems repaired before this baby blows. I'll have my guys unlock the doors out of here for you. I'll take care of it. You stay and keep the hiss away from the plant if you can. The hiss? That's what we're calling him? Oh, that's catchy. Listen, the radios aren't working, so if you find my boss Salvador out there, could you please ask him what the plan is? I'm sure he will have one by now. I'll keep an eye out for him. He sure has a lot of faith in his boss. I'm pretty sure that Salvador is the next boss which we are going to fight. Anyway, we just found out that there's a guy named Darling. It's him for some real action. <laughs> that's, that's, that's really funny. Alright, so we got a uh, couple of uh, things to do. Fix the NSC coolant pumps and also fix the NSC energy converters, which I'll be doing it in the next video. This video has been consumed so much of, uh, you know, cinematics, cutscenes and everything. Alright, we know what's going on, we know what needs to be done, so just a warm up. We'll be taking care of these coolant pumps and uh, the NSC will be saved. By the power of Jesse. Alright, you know guys, it wasn't fun. It was fun playing this, and uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Stick around and uh, make sure to watch this whole series. Take care, guys. Peace out.